Good morning, everybody. 21 degrees out this morning. Burr. Might be a mistake, but I'm not doing any lighting today. It's already like quarter of seven, so it's lightening up pretty fast. Oh, I slept okay. I got to bed, I don't even know, a little after 11.30, I think. I got done editing, exporting, and uploading, so. My brain was going a little bit, but I fell asleep. So. Oh, yeah, yeah, bitter freaking cold this morning, 21 degrees. Oh, the doggies are in their jackets. <laughs> doggies would even come up here to show them. Yep, but we got coats on this morning. It's frigid out. Turn the mics off for a minute so we can hear the birds chirping. Despite it being so cold, <laughs> they're quite noisy this morning. Looks like we might get a pretty shot over this way today. I'm so happy I figured out why this thing wasn't aiming right. Come on, guys. You got a hole. We're not doing anything we don't normally do. <laughs> Taylor's like sulking. He's like, oh, I want to go back to bed. <laughs> Priya was actually the first one to do her boom boom, so. All right. Oh, oh, oh. There we go. I think we're going to get a boom boom. Pretty this morning. All right. Clear skies. Looks like it might be a decent day. I don't know what's going to go up to, but at least it's starting off pretty. I remember there was a time when this was like the morning shot every day. Looking through where this tree is just sitting here that broke off. <laughs> kind of crazy that it's still there just sitting. It's held in pretty good by the other branches, but... Yeah, puppy sniff. And the kids. Oh, yeah. <laughs> kind of surprised Priya is not walking more because she's done all her business. She's just done sniff patrol now. And we're not cutting through there, Priya. I really want to watch back uh, the part of the video yesterday when I, I started playing it and shared it and all that. But when I try to do like the quick little back-to-back -back shots with the iPhone versus the Pocket, because I'm going to be honest with you, pre-rendering, the Pocket looked better. That one-inch sensor might do something uh, pretty amazing. At least that was the pre-edit. I'm kind of curious when it actually played, after it rendered and exported, because definitely get a much different uh, look at it. I could always set Final Cut back up to you know, for quality instead of speed, because right now I still have it set on speed to get through, so it'll actually show me more of true what the video is going to look like when I when I export it. So, but yeah, it just seemed to be a little crisper in the trees than the uh, the iPhone, but it could just be the the ProRes. It takes longer for it to render and uh, clean up. I'll see. But uh, now I'm, I'm happy I did the little changeover with the microphone that I'm not doing all these extra audio recordings because it's, it's taking up space, it's taking up time, um, and it makes it a lot easier if I decide to use the iPhone for a shot, I can hit record, and as long as I feel the thing vibrate right, that's been my only problem is... There was another clip I did that it didn't, the night clip with the sky didn't work because I didn't feel the thing vibrate and it was just weird, so. <sighs> Give him a couple seconds here to sniff and then I'm gonna have to pull Priya away because she'll never leave here if I don't. Hey princess, you'll never leave here. It's like, there's just so much to smell, dad. I gotta smell it all. yelling at me about the endpoints limits. I don't know. All I did was turn it around and face that direction. All right, guys, come on. Come on. That's enough. Let's go. You just can't get enough, can you? Huh? Can you? No, you cannot. 
Mateo, we're not going back over there, buddy. Give the sister a couple seconds in the grass here to tinkle so she can spread her love. <laughs> well, at least while editing last night, I could see the stars with, from the pocket. Of course, I did mention I took some pictures too. I was actually sent them to Mike. Uh, <laughs> I managed to get the moon in one time with the iPhone last night and then it wouldn't do it again. It was really weird. It's kind of hit or miss with that. It's, honestly, to the naked eye, you couldn't see a whole lot of detail last night. I don't understand the different phases, but uh, the <laughs> Samsung didn't do too great. I mean, don't get me wrong. It managed to adjust the brightness and everything and get the shot. But night photo, it looks it just looks like you're zoomed in on the star. It is really weird. I sent it to Mike. I was like, this is a night photo. He sent me a laughing emoji. Uh, I mean it's it's pretty, but it's not very vibrant this morning. Nonetheless. I love the trees in it. Until they get leaves and it doesn't have the silhouette. Sun's coming up now. Getting a little earlier. Of course, you know, once we get on the highway, we won't be able to see them anymore. <laughs> it's crazy. <laughs> Might as well get them all I can. Good morning, Mr. Sun. He's hiding behind houses now, but I think I'm going to have my sunglasses at the ready. There's, there's going to be spots where he just kind of like jets through, like just now, and I'm now blinded. Okay. March 22nd. Uh, yeah, it's uh, well, it's up to 24 degrees. I did change jackets because in the car, that other one's way too much. I'll just basically be running right into work, so... Oh, Friday, Friday, Friday. Good evening, everybody. I know, I've been missing for a while. Just got home and got busy. Alrighty, well, we're in a new, uh, <laughs> I'm out of my brand right now. I'm actually wearing a North Face for the first time ever. But I figure being nighttime in a white jacket might be better. I don't think I need the light right now quite yet, but you know, we'll get it mounted anyway. Uh, I know, face ID. Oh wow, that really brightens me up with the lighter jacket. Gotta get this collar fixed though. But anywho, no, uh, we got that Ivy uh, privacy stuff off Amazon and it showed up today. So as soon as I got home, I unboxed it and started snapping it together. I should have time lapsed it, I really should have. <laughs> it was like I was already halfway done when I figured that out. It's really clever stuff goes together pretty nice and uh, the only problem is after we put the first pieces in so that they when they stand on the step and see other animals we realize that all they got to do is move down the patio what are you barking it's like this thing's aiming really weird tonight but uh, yeah so that's what I got into and just uh, then we started we we're making dinner I was actually making the baked potatoes prior to uh, finishing <laughs> sorry trying to see where the heck I'm going I don't want the light up in the air I'm dragging pretty along here as triggers out and she's freaking out because of it. Let her go. Ugh, unlock her. Come on, guys, get across the street. We don't want to get hit by a car. Um, yeah, then dinner and watch two episodes of Will Trent, and now it's a final puppy walk. So, I should have filmed that. I really should have, because that would have been more entertaining probably than this. Okay, we'll stop for a minute. Hey, you little man. And the princess. Out for our nightly walk. Hopefully it's, uh... It's not as dark as it was last night, so I think they might not be as bad. I don't even know tell time it is. It's got to be going for 8 o'clock. I don't think it is yet, though. 7.55. I see if the light is down too far. I can't see where I'm going, but it blinds the camera. So, the internet. Excuse me. I apologize. <laughs> the only problem I'm having with this thing is, so this side here, they've already cut the little cover off the last the Velcro thing. This one's dangling. It's driving me nuts. So... Terry washed it today. We have to get out one of my new pair of pants tonight, too. Oh, yeah. 
yes. So, well, I did get my uh, my eyes checked today too. So, they did my left eye did change a little bit. Um, right one didn't, but uh, the doctor's like, do you want this in single vision or do you want uh, multifocal? I'm like, am I to that point? He goes, mm, 150 ad. I'm not getting new glasses right now, but in case I start having more problems down the road here, at least I can I can always get that filled at some point. I thought it was getting there. 46 years old and don't need a bifocal yet. That's about six years beyond the normal point in the human eye when the elasticity starts to go in it and focusing on small print becomes an issue. So it's actually like the, it's, your eyes are crazy the amount what they do. <laughs> and it's gotten cloudy out. It's not a pretty sunset tonight. It's very cloudy, but it's warmer. It's like 40 out. So I don't know what the down, what's going down to tonight. Hopefully not 21 again. That sucked last night. Uh, okay, what are you doing, camera? Okay, I didn't want to do that. I wanted to do, yeah, that. <laughs> so, to some extent, come on, go down. This thing still acts up every once in a while. It doesn't like a lot of movement real fast. It's where a traditional camera kind of comes in handy. But I did watch back the iPhone footage versus the uh, pocket footage. I think they're pretty close to being on par, which is kind of amazing considering the fact that the, the iPhone is running with, you know, a much higher file size because it's, you know, not compressed. So DJI is definitely doing something amazing. And the white microphone is now once again on its way. It should be here Sunday. Order the blinds. They should be here sometime in April. Um, what else did I put on that order? Oh, two batteries for this thing. So we're, that's it. We're, I, I, I spent 16 more dollars in going through DJI, but I get the rewards. So plus I had an $18 and a $36 credit. So that makes up the, the little bit of a difference. Eventually I'll get the other two blinds for the upstairs, my upstairs room to make them all the same. But right now we're just gonna swap the one from downstairs upstairs. All right, there's our next target. Let, let the doggies sniff, let them do their thing and call the night. So thank you very much for watching. Thumb up if you liked today's video. I will see you tomorrow as always. Have a good night and stay safe. To you as I talked about it, but I forgot to show you. So that corner is concealed so the doggies can't see. But this is the side that we feel like we kind of messed up on a little bit because all the dogs have to do is come over to here. But I am going to add another panel and hook it to the door because there's enough play there that it'll swing. Still, I can't find my freaking Gerber. I don't know what the hell I did with it. I put, and I still have four panels left over. So that's the size of them. They're not very big. And you have to put them all together. So that is six by six or no six by three for two panels so it goes all the way back in there which we could pull this way probably a little bit but i still think they'd see back in be able to see through